I know. It's gone. I had to chop it off. I'm too lazy to go to the barber shop. I just chopped it off. It's hot. Old, a new movie from M. Night Shyamalan is in theaters now, and it's about this family that goes on a beach where time speeds up very, very fast, only on the beach. It's hard to talk about this movie without revealing any spoilers, but I'm going to try my best anyways. It's been about 20 years since M. Night Shyamalan's first film, and you could see that he's truly mastered the craft of filmmaking in this movie. Throughout the film, you notice his signature style with long dialogue sequences, and very wide shots. For the scenes, the shot looked exactly like the scene from Unbreakable when Bruce Willis is being told that he survived the train wreck. This film's really interesting because there's a family. There's a mom, a dad, and two kids. One of the kids is six, one is 11. And with time going so fast, these kids are actually getting older throughout the movie, so they have to have different actors play these kids. And it shows it in the trailer, but these kids end up being adults at some point, and these are adults that have to act like their brain has matured to be an adult, but they're still a kid. It's really interesting how these actors play that out. One thing I really liked about this film is that once the family ends up on the beach, things start going kind of crazy right away. So it's not like a slow burn and you have to wait for the big reveal. There is just crazy stuff happening throughout this entire film. The family is not the only people that are on the beach, though. There are other people on the beach. One of them, luckily, just so happens to be a doctor, a nice person to have in this type of situation but things are going really crazy and everyone's really confused and he has to figure out how to save his own people and all the other people in the beach are like you're a doctor you gotta help us so he's being pulled in all these directions the doctor's played by Rufus Sowell and he's a legendary actor and just commands the screen I mean all the actors are great but he was like just the best in the movie there is a big twist in this movie we're not going to talk about that but one thing I do want to talk about that's kind of spoilery but it was in the trailer it's those uh those young kids well uh, they end up getting bigger and, you know, they start feeling funny. They're going through all the, you know, the, the, like they're growing up, right? And then they end up in a tent for a little bit. And then immediately after leaving the tent, the girl is pregnant. It felt kind of taboo. It was kind of a weird thing that happened in the movie. But it did, like, add to the story to a point because, like, if these kids are now adults, you know what I mean? And I don't know. It makes sense. Overall, I think it was a great movie from M. Not Shyamalan. Not one of his best movies, but it's up there. Definitely better than his worst movies. I'm going to rate this movie 6.9. Locked in. Thank you guys very much for watching my second ever movie review. If you want to watch my first one, I'm probably going to link it down after the end of the video. You can click one of those cards. If you saw the movie, let me know what you thought down in the comments below. Hit the like button. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And I'll see you next time.